Everybody to bottle it out final Make some fucking noise Now these guys are gonna bottle it out right now for 300 pounds Bro you ain't even a rival But you can call me Moses cause I'm about to break C To make my way to the title Dad got sick shit that can sever you Bring beef and I'll just lever you And that's where it cause I'm clever too <laughs> <laughs> Evo, going first. Hey, I'm predicting his strategy. Ronnie Colbert. He's gonna say that I'm a shotty horror wannabe. I don't let them fables bother me. See, I'm not about what he spits. You're nearly 40 years old, Jeffers. And you have a tattoo in it. <laughs> What's a prick? Or is that just another way to say that you're still down with the kids? You shouldn't even be here, bro. You should be in hospital. Getting more scans and clipping your hair ready for your rock. But in here, there's less of a chance of living. So you don't stand a chance of winning. I never had the right stance to hit him when I grab that title belt and give you another aneurysm. See, I'm on my wrestling steer, brother. Or some no holds barred kind of shit. So you won't stop because this knob is insane. I just grab a steel chair and pop that blob on your brain. <laughs> Leave you in a coffin. It's real when I drop that box in the grave, then apologise to your daughter for leaving her fatherless mate. But wait. No reactions. Come on, man. <laughs> He's been through some hard times, Jeffers has. See, I can respect that. Because H is one hell of a drug. But now you're faced with V, I'm a different kind of strain. So you're more like a sedative, bro, but wait and let me put that into perspective. <laughs> I'm going to save all that negative stuff, but I'm going to fuck up your life more than what the heroine's done. Oh, I'm joking. You think I've come here to take a loss? <laughs> no. I've just come to fucking throw you abuse. See, I'm not talking travel to France when I say that you're going to lose. Nah. <laughs> and who's here to spur him on? No one. <laughs> I'll leave his white heart lane frail on the ground. What? I'm supposed to respect you because you had to buy or evil have made other opponents bail out? Save it. It doesn't matter who it is. I tackle MCs, that's how I take them down to the ground so you can stay right. But if you left, you wouldn't be like Lennon when he got his brains blown out. Yeah. Time. Time, yeah, make some noise! Hey! 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 Okay, first round is on Jeffers. Yo. You know, I think with that heroin shit, you just misunderstand, bro. Because when they talk about Jeffers and his raps, they just say they dig me and I'm dope. <laughs> yo, yo. So it's the battle in our final. 300 pounds. Now let's go. Because I bet anyone in this crowd 300 pounds that I win and he chokes. Because you'll struggle to find a battle where he don't. So how the fuck you gonna cope when the rings I'm running round you start to tighten round your throat? You realise it's not a joke. This ain't a, this ain't just pride. The stakes are dope. I'll stay composed and completely in control. So you should know I'm gonna go the fuck in. Like fuck him. Looking like some <laughs> drug thin butch shim who loves rim. No, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm the body collector for Dominic Webster. You'd probably molest her a lot for a tenner. Take knob off a fella locked in a cellar. You act cocky and clever, but what you drop in just never seems to back it up. So let's back it up to when this tournament actually begun. Because since then, what the fuck have you done? I haven't taken my foot off the gas. I've just tightened the clutch. I've been switching gears fast and I ain't even broke once. It's been exhausting, hard work, tiring. But look, we need to be a high performance team if as a league we want to excel our raters up. Oh, but yeah, you're just man. that mug who always comes and he's unprepared, he makes himself and this league look bad, but he just doesn't fucking care. I should tie you to some spinning office chairs and fly and kick you down a lot of stairs. <laughs> <laughs> then place a piece of fruit at the side of your head and tell the paramedics that you fell when your vision got impaired. I'll have you running scared, he's not a threat. you barely managed five minutes of material since the first event. You haven't earned your place in the final and you don't deserve no respect when the only reason you're here is you're the, in your battles you're the rapper that choked less. Time. <laughs> Time, it's a Hey. Okay, second round is on Evo. So, another battle is the underdog, eh? I fucking love it. No pressure on me there then, but I think it's time that I prove I'm hungry. See, I pussy footed around MCs. I didn't really prepare for the Muppets, but I've got some work. I just hope you're prepared to receive what's coming. So everybody, grab a chair. I think it's time I declare this geezer's punishment, this death by battle rap. He must be visually impaired to not see I'm cunning. But listen, you fucking muppet. Only Chris Jeffers can back out of a tournament and then get back in. <laughs> it's a sign though, because me versus Blitz or Junction, 
would it make for a good final? <laughs> see, I can see Evil is Vision, it's spot on by the way, but it doesn't take away the fact that it was snide. Another MC who got a wave or a bye, just to see them get a wave goodbye. <laughs> but hey, that's life, and now your life is in my hands now. Why? Because I've got the world in it. See, I can crush you with an instant with my palm. You in the world, innit? But I'd rather torture you like an insect. Under a glass, I will hurt him so while that light shining on you in your rounds, we can all stare at you burning. I help that cause. So I spit fire, I'm shit hot. See, I look good when I'm working. I look fucking good when I'm working, but. Bastard. Um, I look good when I'm working. Oh, you dick. Um, <laughs> I don't get no respect for my verses, but after today, you will see that I've earned it. Let's talk about the differences between me and you, right? I'm shit hot and you're just shit. <laughs> We've both got bars, but nobody believes what you spit. I perform my lyrics. You sound like you're reading a script. See, this ain't a fucking audition for a leading role, mate. You've had your two seconds of fame in a flick. Wait for it. For one frame, it was sick when the BBC cameras panned to the crowd, seeing Chris Jeffers for like one second, he paused it, <laughs> uploaded it to Facebook and he's like, Get a load of this! <laughs> <laughs> Wait, does that even really deserve a dissing? Does that little cameo role in people like us made him the most famous person from Skipton? <laughs> and I'm not kidding. Time. Time! Make some noise! Yeah. Okay, second round, it's on Jeffers! Yo, Jeffers. now Dominic's domestically dominated because his bird's a dominatrix. She ties him up, chains him, makes him wear a Pulp Fiction gimp mask when she restrains him, <laughs> then proceeds to give him deep penetrating anal with a ladle till his arse looks like a bagel. <laughs> then he's straight to stage two, a torture rack where his balls get clamped, and she goes to all that trouble just to stop you talking back. <laughs> Good twat. I'll never get battle rappers like that, or even begin to understand. Why do you turn up to battle so unprepared and just pause? Like a bear's hand. See, if it's war, of course I'm tearing strands. I'll set off an unprecedented frenzied attack, because I've set precedence every time I've ascended a, attended a class. That's why since I debuted in June, I've ascended my rank, putting time, work and effort, perfecting my craft. So even off a week's prep, you know you're still getting smashed. And when you start talking them gum bars, don't fucking make me laugh. Are you daft? The only time you've unloaded yours is when you've had a wank straight in the bath. <laughs> now, now if I had a gap, it'd be a sniper, silent assassinations, and once I got you in sights, let off twice, one shot to each eye, leaving you blind. But shit, that's that ray gun. <laughs> ray gun, ray gun. Yo, when I finish this with shades on, yo, a villa's got me feeling like a pagan, and this stage is my sacrificial table. See, I've, I'm an original guy, I don't fit to a label. I've got a one of, I'm a one of a kind rhymer, and you know what? You ain't, bro. So take notes, because it's case closed. The people back home, they know. I'm that much of a gangster, the grass don't even get mown. Seeds, <laughs> seeds don't even get thrown, and veg don't even get grown. Unless people bring me some hoes, and I say so. <laughs> Time! Time! Oh, it's yeah. nice. Evil. Right, so you all like schemes? Yeah. 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 Say, so you all like schemes? Yeah. 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 Oh, I like it. Well, I've got a scheme. So right now, I want you to all close your eyes and picture this scene, because I'm about to get deep. Okay. Nice one. <laughs> Chris <laughs> Jeffers, old dear, foaming out the mouth with his nose bleeding, lighting in the ambulance. Kaylee squeezing his hand, screaming, looking lifeless, eyes wide white, looking straight at the ceiling. He's not responsive to the light, the doctor's shining, he's not breathing. The blue light's wailing to the hospital so they can save him with some treatment. But Kaylee's not allowed in the room. She's on the floor kneeling, pleading for Jesus to spare his life for whatever reason. Then he gets hooked up to some tube, but he don't mind, because he likes needles. <laughs> but that last injection you had was one drop away from being lethal. So it's only right that there's so many people in the room because it's vital. It's a known fact that it takes less people to deliver a child than it does to save your life, but what goes around comes around, see? This isn't nothing but a cycle, so they put H in your IV just to give you aid in your survival. Nice! Good part that, innit, yeah? yeah? Right, so what fucking, what 30 something, nearly pushing 40s guy, wakes up in the morning and thinks Battle Rap is his calling. <laughs> just Chris Jeffers. Alright. Well, now I'm gonna fucking, now I'm gonna push for his retirement. But you should be out working towards it. I ain't lying, you should be out saving money for a better life for your daughter. Not wasting dough on the trains for shows. That's crossing the border. 
You can call me a hoarder now, you can all bear witness to the old sacrificial lamb to get slaughtered. Let's talk about that age difference for like what? one second difference. See, I'll wash my hair, you wash your grey hair, what you think? See, while I was out playing in a park as a kid, he was out on a heroin binge with his heroin bin, robbing houses, committing plenty of sins, searching through empty bins and looking on the floor to find a dirty needle to put your heroin in. That's just disgusting, man. Anybody else think that was below the belt? Yeah. yeah. Hell no! Does anybody know what was below his belt? Hell, Hell no! no. <laughs> 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 fucking see, right? He fucking make a beat with his thing. Couldn't find it, so he tightened the veil, bro. <laughs> Tap it again to get his fix and then just... Mellow. <laughs> Paul Raptor did say it, yeah? Your skin does look yellow. I'm not fucking surprised because it figures, because after all that abuse, the heroin must have fucked with your liver. Oh, you lot can beg to differ. I don't give a fuck. I've witnessed it first hand. And another thing that I've always wondered, you're an MC, right? My wife never seen no tracks. Because you ain't looked. Because he's always fucking wearing a jumper. No. <laughs> 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 hey, Very the final round on Jeffers. Yo, yo, so let's have a quick tournament recap. First round, a bodied relapse. Went straight on at a junction to defeat a charging rhino and find my place in the final. Now let's recap yours. No, because they're all shit and no one wants reminded. Let, I, does, I know the exact formula for this guy's style if anyone wants to try it. You start off rhyming, then you move to a bit of miming. Before the ancient but mysterious art of silent freestyling. Before <laughs> <laughs> you call time in it, ain't time. There's still half a fucking round left. You're on Jeff Row now, matey. The only Jeff thing you've found is dead. <laughs> Especially, especially when you're both physically and lyrically inept, your bars like content, substance, depth, and this clash would be a complete waste of breath if catching your body wasn't cashing me a check. But it is, so I'm attacking and slashing at his flesh. Uh, this is corporal punishment in general, soldier, and I demand respect. Spitfires that have you banking left till a hurricane plainly has your ankle swept and you're a mangled mess. And then I'll throw a mango at your head. It wouldn't feel like a battle if I didn't threaten you with fruit and veg. And say that you have tuna breath. Your mum brings me a brew in bed before fruity sex. And it's, and it's, oh, she brings me a brew in bed before juicy sex. And it's gruesome when she screws my length. Because I fuck her that hard, I bruise her neck. And leave her that loose and wet, you could lose a leg. She's a moose and sket and she could use some help. Because she's been fucking her own son. That's you, Dominic. Since the age of 12. Ah, but, ah, fuck. Since the age of 12. But we, ah, oh, fuck. Fucking hell. Fucking hell. Since, since the age of 12. But my whole game plan today was just to come more prepped. Ah, oh, fuck that up anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. Ah, oh, fucking time, man. Fuck. Time, make some noise for that ball. Yeah. Yeah. Back with the judges, yeah? Are you enjoying it? We're up in Warrington right now. Oh, yeah. Shouts out to, to my uncle Shai Horror. Shouts out to Dad Three Ways every single time. <laughs> Dad just, three watch, ways. just watch Jeff versus Evo <laughs> for the tournament final. And I was judging it on the fact that Jeff is second round and Evo's third was the most impressive. I think like the others were kind of weak and they were a bit sketchy at points. And I was going to give it to Jeffers until he choked at the last minute in the third. And I did really feel bad for him because his substance and material was really hitting home. But I gave it to Evo more for the consistency, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, shouts out to Jeffers and shouts out to Evo, but I gave that to Evo. Shari Hara! Yo! It's Kim Kardashian's latest acquisition. <laughs> <laughs> um, basically, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do the same thing like with Jeff in his second round, and then Evo's third round was the shit that I was gonna base the battle on because I wasn't too impressed by most of the stuff coming up. It seemed like a bit normal, do you know, like the stuff where you know what's gonna get a crowd going, but shit needs to transcend to footage in it. So to the shit that I thought would transcend to footage, I thought Evo. 
had a lot more, there was a lot more schemes and um, smart around balls and stuff coming in and, and that's why I found it just a difference. Although like um, Jeff has had motors and stuff like that and this second round was sick and his motors were sick and that. I just believe it was more on content and um, just drag, like, my man brought a choke back as well, get me evil, brought a choke back, takes a lot to do that um, and Jeff is going to do that so I say it was that close and it was down to but for me, it was down to content, he was content, and the fact that he tried to choke back when Jeff was doing so. Hey, horror motherfucker, what's the camera still on Facebook, man? This guy put Dave Zabella's fucking phone cuts and shit. I've switched. Dave, Dave, he villains the Bella. Dave Villa. All Dave Zabella. Go on. Alright, so we just watched Battle in it out final. Should say big up to a goal. Sure, yeah. Um, as he said, man, there, was, there was a difference. There was a difference between them, and that is like you know, it's your composure. And if you lose it, you know, and you forget your words, and you get back on it, then pretty much it's not a joke, man. It is. It's, it's just a loss of composure. Unfortunately, Jeff has just got his round, didn't he? So it's like <laughs> he's asleep, man. Majority of them have been to. But uh, nah, nah, seriously, I thought, I thought Jeff has came nice and unfortunately the third round lost in the third so he won. <laughs> yes, it's day three ways. I think three ways won the battle. You know. Three ways won. Oh, 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 okay. Yeah, so Jeff is <laughs> Okay. Well, it's, already, it's already over now, isn't it? Anyway, um, why is it? Why is it just me? Yeah, I thought Jeff was. May have missed the first two rounds, but then Evo's food was really good, man. I really, I quite liked his first rounds, and that kind of like brings it um, to a draw sort of thing. Um, if I was doing it on rounds, though, I would say that Jeff has edged the first two, in my opinion. Uh, Evo was a bit slow out of the box. He definitely won in the third. But I would probably edge Jeff as two one, maybe, but he doesn't matter because Evo's won, so it doesn't really matter. But I'll just give it Jeff because I think it's close, so I think 3 2 is a fair result, so yeah, I'd want to say Jeff.